I mean, we're just able to tell it's the head, so that's good. Head first, that's what we want. So we're still waiting. Poor mama's in pain. And we'll continue to monitor her and make sure everything goes good. She has a very large bag of milk, a lot larger than her first calf last year. So I guess she's getting more mature. She's also a big pet. She's our baby. Uh, one of the grandchildren said it's her favorite cow. Another young heifer has gone to visit. She is pregnant with her first calf and it's like she's trying to console the new the mama that's about to have a baby now. I didn't get here in time. She moved way to the back I had to leave where I was and come in through another gate and by the time I got here the baby was born. But as you can see, success. I guess the donkey helped. Well, everybody's happy. And here comes dad to see what happened. Well, we didn't get to see the final stage of the birth, but that's okay. I'm just happy that the baby is healthy, and it's actually trying to get up, but it's going to take a little bit. Dad is here. Donkey's excited. Everybody's coming to see the baby and say hello. Mama's cleaning it now. It's a big calf, but mama is a tall, it is a tall mama. You see how tall she is. You see, she already looks a little thinner now that she's had the baby. We'll have to get the weight back on her. She'll have to get some grain and some green grass. We can get some rain around here. The baby will be up in a little bit, don't worry. A little play between the three youngest. It's cooling off now in the evening and we're going to have a little playground competition between the three youngest here. And the fourth youngest joins for their evening play. Uh-oh, here we go. Two teenagers here going at it. And that one wins. And the two youngest ones say, so that's how you do it. The remainder have gone to eat hay for the rest of the night right up till dark. We'll see the baby in the morning. <laughs>